Think of all the times you've interacted with a nurse. How many of them were men? If the answer to that is not many, it's because men make up just 13% of the nation's nursing workforce. And today I had the chance to meet with the founding member of a new nursing club at Pitt that is trying to break the stigma around male, nurse, male nurses. Uh, so this is how we typically like intubate someone. Nurse Adrian Bermuda shows us just one of the skills nurses need to master. They practice on these guys who don't mind any first time jitters. My favorite part of nursing would just have to be the patient interaction. Um, you meet some of these people at their worst days of their lives and taking care of them, talking to them. Bermudez is now studying at the grad school to become a nurse anesthetist, but the makeup of his classes still looks the same. And even now when I'm a current grad student, I mean, it's uh, you look around the classroom and males are easily the minority. Associate Dean Julius Katutu tells me of the nursing school's 1,070 students, about 140 of them are men. That's why Pitt School of Nursing just created the Men in Nursing Club, a space for networking and mentoring, socializing and recruitment. It removes the stigma from male, uh, out male, men, um, people out there, that nursing is also a profession for men, and you can advance in professionally in the, the line of being a nurse. The club's creation comes on the heels of a big award. Pitt just got named one of the best schools for men in nursing. We have been put in the map uh, in the country as one of the best schools that has um, enabled male nurses or male students to come here and do the program and complete successfully. In addition, we have also told people that uh, we, we are inclusive. For Bermudez, the club's not just a chance for him to serve as a role model for younger nurses, but to honor his own. I was fortunate enough to have two role models in my life. My mom was a nurse and my grandmother was a nurse, and they kind of influenced me that I can go into the nursing profession and I can be very successful. And one other interesting thing we learned today is that now Pitt School of Nursing, they're going to try to reach out to local high schools to try to get some younger kids, especially the younger male students yeah. interested in nursing and kind of explain what all it entails. Yeah, hopefully it's successful because there is this shortage, nursing, teaching, yeah. uh, police officers. I know that some of that's being talked about at the state level, but it's good to see that local, that local effort. Yeah, they said you'd get a job right away if you have yeah. your nursing degree.